Take a live look now over SeaTac Airport as we close in on a very busy holiday travel season. Right now, travel here is running smoothly with only one cancellation, about 100 delays. Travelers going through SeaTac are being told, though, to prepare for the crowds and the construction. King 5's Connor Board joining us from the airport live tonight with the latest there. Connor. There are several construction projects underway here at the airport, including behind me here in the ticketing area. That's why airport leaders are telling people to come with extra time and extra patience this holiday. This is SeaTac Airport on a normal Thursday afternoon, a week before they expect a possible record breaking number of Thanksgiving travelers. However early you're thinking about coming, come an hour earlier. Joanna Bailey flies through SeaTac three to four times a month and has seen the airport's challenges. You always got to prepare for long wait times, whether you're dropping off the rental car, getting over here, whether you're getting in line, you know, to do the pre-screening, just getting through the pre-screening. The airport is hoping to alleviate some of those challenges by creating a new security line and ticketing area, but for now, that means construction. Some of the spaces that you're going to see are a lot more crowded than what they were before because we've got construction barriers up and they're a lot more narrower, especially in the north end where our Alaska customers are in the main terminal. Airport spokesperson Perry Cooper says it will be cramped as they are expecting 1.5 million people between today and November 27th. That's an 11% increase in travelers this Thanksgiving holiday when compared to last year. We're getting back to those record levels once again. At the end of the year, we're expecting to be right around 2019 levels. In the past, like in this photo from last September, lines for ticketing stretched into the garage. And last Christmas, many people's baggage didn't get to their flights as luggage overwhelmed conveyor belts. Well, we think we've gotten over those humps, the challenges that we had over last year, um, get those solved. Cooper says although construction can be frustrating for people now, it will pay off in the future, something travelers look forward to. You know, you always got to go through the, the tough pinch points before things actually get better. The peak travel days for Thanksgiving here at the airport will be the Wednesday, Thursday and Monday surrounding the holiday and the busiest time of day is in the mornings, Joyce. Well, Connor, when do they expect this construction to be done? For this specific project in the ticketing and baggage areas, the completion date is fall of next year. But this is all part of a $5 billion upgrade project that will take about five years to complete. Back to you, Joyce. Connor Board at SeaTac.